We're back at it. We're back at it. Once again, I'm Malik Zaire, and joining us now is Ryan Sachery, the Callahan family men's tennis coach who is one of the top players in the history of Notre Dame's men's tennis. Ryan, welcome to the fight. Malik, good to be here, my man. I appreciate y'all having me. Absolutely. When you were deciding which college to attend, what was the recruiting pitch from Notre Dame, and how did you end up here? Well, it's a good question. You know, actually, I'm an Ohio native uh, like yourself, Malik. And, there we and go. Uh, I think when, when we all go through the process, um, it's not about the pitch. It's about the people. Um, and, and that was certainly the, the case with me. When I came to visit, I, I did not grow up a Notre Dame fan uh, when I was when I was a young kid. But when I came to visit the campus and and, and met all the people and, and saw all the opportunities in Notre Dame, had to provide for for not only tennis players but general students as well and, and just the environment and the culture on campus you know i knew it was the right place for me to be and and uh made my decision rather rather easy now when you look back at the four years you were here what do you remember most and and how did it how do you say how did it translate for you as your career went past that at the, past notre dame yeah you know tennis is is an individual sport um, at every other level, whether it's junior tennis, professional tennis, whatever, you're, you're playing by yourself. Um, but when, when you're in college, you're, you're playing for a team. And, and for me, that was representing Notre Dame, being a part of the Notre Dame family, the Notre Dame community, uh, was something that was really special and magical. And, and in my honest opinion, brought the best level of tennis out in me. Um, and, and so as transitioning into into coaching, I, I try to bring that passion for this place and this university and um, all that it stands for and all that we're about every day to our student athletes and, and try to give them the best experience we can give them. Um, but but really for me, it's about the team and, and about representing something bigger than yourself and, and something special like Notre Dame. Now, does it make it easier being a player now transitioning to a coach that you can relate to those guys on the team and and put yourself in their shoes? Yeah, absolutely. No, it, it does. And especially having done it here at Notre Dame, where, where the balance between the academics and, and the athletics is a little bit um, maybe more strenuous than it is at some other schools. So, I, you know, I, I've lived the life. My assistant coach, who's unbelievable, is also a legend in our program, um, a very successful student athlete here in, in men's tennis as well. The, the two of us have, have, have walked in the shoes of our guys. And, and uh, no, I, I do think it helps us because, again, we've had that shared experience with our players. And being in the ACC means you're always facing a tough schedule. So tell us about the team and, and your hopes that you're coming up for this season. Like, what do you think is you're most excited for coming up? Yeah, well, we're excited to play, number one, <laughs> and just get out there and compete. Um, you know, we, we did not do any of that in the fall, uh, which, was, which was very different for, for tennis players. And so, you know, it's been, it's been a good nine and a half months uh, since since we've really competed with live bullets, let's say against against other competitions. So, number one, just having the opportunity to get out there, and, and I echo Coach Gia was on just now and, and talking about the appreciation for our, our administration, our athletic department for establishing the protocols for return to play um, that give us the, the opportunity to compete. And so that's number one. But number two, we return a really really strong nucleus, the team that was ranked as high as number eleven in the country two years ago um 2019 spring and and the vast majority of the bulk of that core of our group is back and so we we have really high expectations we have a very veteran crew and like i said most importantly we're just excited to compete and grateful for the opportunity and ready to ready to get it on i'm excited to see it myself and we know that you're putting a lot of work on the court but how do your student athletes get involved in the local community you know, it's a great question and I uh, appreciate you asking that. And, and obviously COVID has, has uh, limited a lot of the impact that, that we can make. Uh, but, it, you know, in, in addition to the fight for life, in addition to the, the normal community service, uh, whether it's reading at elementary schools, visiting hospitals, et cetera. Um, you know, one of the unique things about our program is that we're able to open up our facility to the outside community. And, and our assistant coaches primarily are the ones that, that run clinics in the evening and and so really kind of fostering, again, that, that community impact and, and having our program and our student athletes and our facilities at the forefront of tennis in the South Bend community. Well, Coach Sachery, thank you so much for being with us today and good luck in the season. Go Irish. Go Irish, baby.